Good morning again. I am going to go over my morning makeup with everybody. I have put on all my skincare. I did my anti-wrinkle. I did my Serum C Climate Control, my moisturizer, and then last but not least, I put on Silk. Silk is a pore and wrinkle minimizer, and it goes on before your foundation, and it fills up all the holes and the wrinkles so your makeup goes on smooth and it doesn't cake inside all your little pores. And so I've used a suede foundation. I put on my suede foundation and then I literally just stopple on my foundation all over my face. The stoppling, and sometimes I rub, um, the stoppling will give you an airbrush look on your face versus um, I used to be a finger gal, and but I have found this brush, and I am in love with this brush. Um, but just to staple it on, there's just little, little dots all over your face, and it gives you the airbrushed, airbrushed look. So you do that, and then we're going to move on to shadows. And so let's go with some snow. I think y'all saw snow the other day when I did my hashtag smoky eye. But I love this snow. It gives a light white coverage all over the base of your eyelid. And so you just cover your eye. And our products are very concentrated. So just a little will go a long way. Might have got a little crazy on that side, see? And you got a one to two minute window before it sets in. And you are good. And see, well, I go, I shave my face. And now my foundation is laying directly on my skin and not my hair. And nobody wants to see foundation hair. My finger, I got on my finger. And what color should we go with today? Garnet? Let's see. Let's do garnet. And so I'm just going to take and wipe off my excess because you just need a little. And so you just put on a little. And then you're going to blend it in. And you can use your finger or a brush. I like my finger because I feel like I have more control. I'm going to get a little more garnet here. And that's it, girls. It is so easy and blendable. And our all of our shadows are creamed to powder. So when they're creamed to powder means you can mix all the colors together, even on a palette, and become your own artist and create whatever color you want. That is what said. Like, if you have a garnet and you're like, oh, that's a little too dark for me, you can mix it together and create your own color. But you also can just blend. And the more you blend, the lighter it will become. And see how quick that was? Easy peasy. And so now I'm going to take the pink opal shimmer. And I like to just put a little light color. Right at the corner of my eye, I feel that it lightens, and then I just pat it in and blend it in with my finger. It lifts my eyes and makes my eyes look wider because I have sunken in eyes. Y'all see that, how they just sink backwards. But when, because right there, see how my eyes shut, my eyelids go in. But if I lighten them up just a little bit, with some lighter shadow scents right here. It makes my eyes look bigger and not so closed. In my opinion, but just a little bit, not a whole lot. Now for your brows, we're moving on to Onyx. If you do not have Onyx shadow scents, oh, you're missing out. It's amazing. It's cream to powder. You take just a little bit. Um, some women, the onyx is too dark for their brows. And so you literally just dab it in. 
dab it in. And I'm going to show you the difference between an eyebrow that is finished and an eyebrow that is unfinished. Because the brow that is finished completely like highlights and finishes this side of my face. This side to me is not finished because your eyes are the eyebrows are your window treatments to your face. So you always want to make sure you have your brows done. But we have a Mocha Java for the lighter haired ladies that works wonders on brows. And so then I take my shut and my onyx. And on my eyes, I have snow, garnet, and pink opal shimmer. And then I literally just take the wand. I wipe off all my access. Access. Y'all like that? Excess. And I use my shadow sense because it has the staying power of our lips. It does not go anywhere. Once it sets, it's there all day till you wash it off. Oh, that's a little difficult. Let's look at this mirror. All right. Now, this is my brow. My eyes are, are my eyeliner. Can we see the difference of having to put on your face, ladies? Putting on your face. I know I'm a little late getting the makeup on today. We had a party last night for Norris Lee 40th birthday, and we had an absolute ball. Did not get home to like what 1 a.m. I don't even remember. And then, oh my gosh, I want everybody to try this. Everybody, go get in your mirror on your phone <laughs> and try to put on your eyeliner through your phone. It's a challenge. Anyway, done with that. Now, our under scents, lash scents. You take, oh, we have a gray size, which is your under scents. If I can get it untangled, untangled, undone. And this goes on, and it makes your lashes look fuller, thicker, longer. And it's just like that. You just paint it on like a little paintbrush. Get it on. Go to this side. Look, I touched my eyeliner. And once it dries. Haha, <laughs> thanks, Kristen. I'm telling you, it's a challenge. I've had to master using the video camera I'm putting makeup on. Because I want you ladies to see how you do this. So I can't be looking over here. See, y'all would never see me. Um... And so you put on the under scents. Then, this is our black waterproof mascara, long lasting, be there all day. Um, Y'all seen Lenore Lee in the pool? She's wearing the mascara. And that's it. And I like to do mine a couple of times because I like mine a little blacker. So, my stomach just growled. So, I missed church this morning. Can y'all believe I missed church? I prayed and thanked God. I was like, I just need to sleep in for a minute. My beautiful husband, he went to church because he's such a good man. I couldn't quite get there, ladies. But we are going to Spring Hill today to meet a friend of mine from high school. I'm so excited. Of seeing her. I haven't seen her in so long. Morning, Norley. See, we had to. I'm going to have to use this mirror, ladies. That is so hard to do. That's it. So, eyes are done. We're going to do some cheeks. We got our blush brush. We have cherry blush. I like the cherry blush. I think that it goes on my skin. Um, you just need a dot. I think it goes on my skin better. My skin's a little darker. Um, there's some of our other blushes. 
But lighter tone skin, we have a chick, uh, chocolate cherry that Lenora uses that she loves. But I'm in love with just the cherry blush. We have a terracotta. We haven't got that in stock, do we, Norley? We're out of stock on that. And there's the cherry blush, ladies. I mean, it's easy peasy. And you think all those steps just to make have your beautiful skin, your skincare, getting all that anti-aging product on your face and all that takes a long time. And it don't. I mean, that's it. You are done. And I'm going to clean my lips. Do I even have any lip scents in here? Well, I do. We're going to wear some Aussie Rose. Where I put lips on Lorelai the other day. I guess it stayed in here. <laughs> it's funny. So you clean your eyes. Oh, and I want you to climb him. <laughs> And so, clean and dry your lips because the lip scents need something to adhere to and it can't adhere to makeup. So, whether you think you got something on your lips, you do. Oh, I almost forgot my powder. And so, we have our powders. We have three colors. We have natural light and silver rose. And the rose just gives you a pink tone. And so, you literally, it's going to be loud. Bang it on your counter. Then you twist it, and that makes all the powder go all the way around the brush. And then it comes out, and y'all see that? And this is just a light finishing powder. It's just to get rid of any little, like, oil spots that look like um, on your face. And it just finishes off your makeup for the day. How easy peasy is that? Now... Let's do a little Aussie Rose. So you shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it. And then you apply in three layers. Layer one is what adheres to your lips. It's going to have a little bit of a tingle to it. And that is a medical grade alcohol that helps it bond to your lips. And then get your bottom waterline. And go outside the line there a little bit. No. Nah. I just missed a spot. Once again, Norley, we had a fun night last night. That's what I was telling y'all earlier. I'm sorry. So we got in late. I slept in and missed church. Mm -hmm. That's why I'm not putting my makeup on till. I know what time it is now, 11 30, 12. Getting ready to go have lunch. <clears throat> Second layer, let dry in between each layer. Um, look at our fans, love them. Oh. And then go to your second, third, and final layer. Get your water line. Let that dry. Glossy gloss. And you are done, ladies. That's how easy it was. I got a hair on my face somewhere. You wouldn't think so because I shaved my face. If you have any questions about shaving your face, let us know. We will answer anything. Any questions you got. Dry lips. Pretty good. Aussie Rose. I got snow, garnet, and um, what I, I think oval shimmer on my eyes. Onyx in my brows. Onyx on my eyeliner. And black lash under scents on my lies. And cherry blush. There it is, ladies. I hope you all have a fabulous Sunday. God bless you. I love you. Bye.